welcome back to the farm everybody i know it's been a little while since our last update but uh truth of the matter was i just needed a little break from uh, uh, youtube for a bit but uh, we are back and we are planning on doing more videos we haven't gone away um so we're we're going to keep pressing on and as you can see it is past 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 time to do a move on the with the chicken tractor i just really hadn't had any time i've been working about every weekend here lately and it's just uh it's making it a little hard to, for the way we do these moves but uh hopefully this this weekend coming up we will be able to uh do a move on the with the chicken uh tractor and i might even do a video about that show how we actually move it and the process it takes to actually move that thing <laughs> so uh but just uh stick around with us we're going to have a little bit of uh well i shouldn't say we're going to have a little bit of fun you might have some fun watching but uh uh i'm going to be doing a little work here i'm going to clean the chicken tractor out and uh what am i going to do with all the shavings and stuff that's inside well let's just say we got a special spot for them <laughs> But before we go any further, first off, I want to say if you're not yet a subscriber, uh, please hit the subscribe button. I'd be honored to have you uh, as a subscriber to this channel. And please, please hit that like button below. I appreciate it. Well, let's take a look and see what we got going on here. And yes, it is a mess. So, been a while since this thing's been cleaned out. I'm trying to remember if it's... Uh, uh, yeah, I think Steph cleaned it out once. But other than that, it hadn't been cleaned out, so it's definitely time for good cleaning. Uh, and that is a broken, broken piece of the perch. Hmm. And before anybody says anything, uh, yes, I know I should have been wearing a mask for that. Uh, which I ended up getting one a little bit later after I dumped that wheelbarrow load because, I mean, it, that stuff is nasty to clean out, and there's a lot of stuff in that that really you just do not want to get in your lungs. So whenever you're cleaning out your chicken house and stuff, don't do as I'm doing right there. Uh, really, you should be wearing a mask, and really, honestly, it should be an N95 mask, which I don't have. So, But anyway... Oh, you should definitely thank PPE when doing stuff like this. I don't know if y'all can tell how wet my hair is, but man, it is humid out here. Uh, all that wet just from sweat. And... It's not a hard job to do, but man, it is when it's humid. But uh, uh, let's take a look. I'll show you the in-between part. Not a perfect cleaning, but it will be uh, just fine considering we're going to be covering that all back up with wood shavings again. So uh, let's uh, let's get this floor covered. Looky, looky, we got eggs. Any more? Nope, that's all of them.
getting dark, so it's kind of hard to tell, but we got a nice, clean chicken house. Those chickens will sit around, scratch that stuff around, and they'll even it out a little bit better, and back it down some more, and they'll feel just right at home. I guess I should fix this thing again. There we go. Nice little perch for them. And on top of what they already have. So dark you can't see, can you? It's been such a rough evening. I think we'll just uh, sit and watch the chickens for a little bit while they're getting ready to settle in for tonight. 